Oh my gosh, I love finding these. Um, usually when I find these, they're still in the box. If this is only a dollar, I'm definitely getting that. All right, well, today I am at City Mission. Um, decided to come here. Maybe they have some glass. Ooh, look at look, look. Oh my gosh. Yes. I believe this is the Blue Heaven. I believe. Um, I always look for the dinner place. They usually have a pattern. How much is it? Five? I don't see any damage. I'm gonna get that. And the teapot. Awesome. I feel like the teapot sells for like 40 to 50. I've never seen the coffee though. Yay! Well, look at what we have here. Ooh, that's pretty. It's edged. That's five dollars. A little bit of scratches. Is that flashed on? Hmm. I'm gonna put it in and think about it. Hey, look at that. I recognize that sticker. Ooh, it's Waterford. Yes. How much is it? Three ninety nine, and it still has the um pattern. Um, sticker on the bottom so it'll be easy to look up. I'll do four dollars on that. For sure. Not really seeing anything too new from the last time I was here. I remember when this was popular. The white. Is that false graph? Yeah, false graph. I think my mom had a small collection. Actually, it wasn't small, it was large. <laughs> she had it in the hutch. That's the brown bag, maybe. Yeah, not worth too much. I do like that, the love doves. Hey, what about this? That's different. Ooh, look at the daisies. Huh. That's different. I like how it's, um, thicker. I don't know, it almost reminds me of recycled glass. Kinda wanna get it, it's $5.99. It's not that heavy though. Look at this epic cat on wall hanging. I thought it was a bag at first. I was gonna get it. <laughs> a tapestry wall hanging. Oh, it's two dollars. Eh. Can't do that. Ooh, look at these. These are just plastic. Um, wind chime. Yeah, a little bit too newer. Oh my gosh, all of these. Oh, I love it. Look at the frog. <laughs> it's a happy frog. What is this down here? Ooh, look at that. Oh my gosh, I love the blue. It comes with a box, $5.99. Let me see. I mean, it's all rusted, corroded. Uh, I don't think I could do that. Six dollars. It's kind of cool that it comes with a box, though. I think that's I'm more attracted to the box. <laughs> oh my gosh! Look how cute this pig is. <gasps> look at that. It's vintage. Um, probably Japan. It's cold painted, so that means the paint was painted on top of the glaze. It's piggy bacon. Oh, it's only, it'll be a dollar fifty. I'm definitely getting that. For sure. What the heck? It's a different design. I like the spoon. <laughs> Isn't that weird? I like the spoon out of all of that. Um, I believe this is for berries. Um, pick the berries and he rinse it. I want to see these dishes. It has olives and I love olives. Oh my gosh. I like the green. <laughs> what do you know? Olive D. Giftware. Look at this bean pot. That'd be six dollars. Ooh, look. What does that say? Watt. USA Pottery. This says Watt, right? W-A-T-T. -T. Let me look that up quick. 
Ah, look at the chip. I want to see how much it's worth. Alright, so it's not really worth picking up um, with damage. Ooh, look at that. Salt glaze. Is that marked? I don't know. How much is that? I feel like it's not expensive. I might do this. I'm surprised there's no markings. Um, I'm thinking like Salmon Falls or... I don't know if it was BBP Pottery, Belmont Brothers, it would be marked. I'm gonna do that. This. This looks, I, w I was thinking Wedgwood. Oh wow, I like that. That'd only be one dollar. Eh. I don't know about it. It does have crazy. Oh, I like this. I can already tell it's a little bit newer, but it has like a mid-century look to it. Made in China. Oh, I like it. A little planter. Well, it's not little, it's a little bit larger. Alright, last time I was here, I accidentally left these two Santa Claus. Is that it? No. There were Santa Claus candles, um, and they were Holt Howard. I had no idea Holt Howard made candles. Those are pretty with the poinsettias. Yeah, they're gone. <laughs> it's okay, no. I know for next time. They're not worth too much, but just to have, because it's Holt Howard. Oh, look at this dish. Fused glass. Oh, what does that say? Oh, look at the price. <laughs> Fusion. Okay, I'm not gonna get it for that price. It'd be even ten dollars. Is there anything else we can look at? What about this? It's plastic. Flingers. Ellinger's doy. I want to look at this. We have this bowl at home. Um, I keep looking at it thinking it's fire and light. No. It's made in Italy. IVV. $4? And then $2.50. So that'd be $2.50 and $2.00. Oh my gosh. Um, look how big it is though. <laughs> I wonder if that could be a booth item. Alright, I looked it up and, I don't know, it doesn't really sell for too much. Um, a, lot of, a lot of people have the clear dishes, plates, with like a gold design around it. Almost like a drip, kind of. But that's pretty for yourself if you want that. That... These might be Italian. Even in China, um... MWW Market. Hmm. Chives and sage and basil. Let's go see if there's anything on this side. Look at these coasters. Um, I always check to see if there's sterling. Um, this one, this looks like it'd be sterling. Where was the mark? There should be a mark. There's the mark. Um, crown sterling. See it right there. Hard to see, but um, two for fifty cents. I'm gonna get that. Ooh, look at these. Oh wow. Um, I'm dinging it. See if it's crystal. I don't think it is. Oh, I like that. You get the blue and the red. It's etched. And then it has the blue or the color added in it. I might get these. Let me put this in so I don't forget. Put that in. Here's some brandy glasses. Ooh, look how chipped up it is. Ooh, look at the Kokeshi. Yes. Oh my gosh, I love finding these. Um, usually when I find these, they're still in the box. But this is only a dollar. I'm definitely getting that. Um, I could use Barkeeper's Friend to get those pencil marks out. 
pencil scratches. Oh, lucky over here, a fresh cart. Yankee candle. There's Michael's fork. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, I see a mug over here. I'm not gonna pick it up because the pie dish is gonna fall. It's probably Pyrex. I want to see who made it. They have chickens and roosters. All right, that is one of the Lang, Lang mugs. Um, probably the box with it. I'm gonna skip over that. Is it possible? Oh, that's McCoy. That's a larger bowl. Let me check that out. Ooh, look at the milk glass. Okay, I am unsure about this one. I believe it says O H O. O H O USA. It'd only be two fifty. I'm gonna get this. I don't know if it's the McCoy version. Um, this will be booth item though. Here's a vintage ashtray. I just found it. Um, Scotch whiskey for five dollars. Put that in, and I know ashtrays are kind of iffy. It matters where it's made and the design, the age. I know I looked it up. It's not worth too much, like nine dollars. <laughs> so I'm not gonna spend five and sell it for nine. That's okay. We have some good stuff in there. What about these? Adirondack style woodland home studio. Hmm. Eight dollars. So before. Oh wow. So I looked up sold comps on these. And a set of six dinner plates sell for about $84. A sold comp for that, and then it comes with two bowls. This is a no-brainer. I'm definitely going to get that. Shipping it might be a pain because it's heavy, and these are heavy. Heavy and big. <laughs> this right here, a salt cellars or a ashtray. I love the design. Oh, my gosh. Look at that. Um, it would be four dollars for the set of four, so a dollar each. I'm gonna do that. These are different. I never seen them before, so I'll try it out. Why not? Yeah, I haven't seen one of these in a long time. <laughs> Probably last year. Um, this is a. It separates the fat from the gravy. No drip gravy separator. Oh, I love it. I can't get it with the chipping though. I learned that from um, our viewers. Cause so I'm looking at it, I'm like, what, 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 what is it for? <laughs> I knew it was for gravy because it said gravy, but I didn't know it separates the fat. And it didn't have that on there either. Look at this really big. Okay, pitcher. It looked like a mug. Just kidding. <laughs> Made in Italy. Two dollars strawberries. Uh, I don't. I don't know about this. I feel like that doesn't sell for much, even though it does say Italy. I just feel like I can't make too much money off of it. It's kind of large, like Michael's fork. I always check for Catherine Holmes. I'm not seeing any. Even a lid. You see about these dishes? Oh, that's the ND exclusive. I can't remember what the ND means. All right, so I decided to stop at the restore. Ooh, first thing I see is Mexican pottery. Oh, look at the bird. It's a spoon rest for only three dollars. I'll do that. I love the how it's red and then it has the turquoise. It makes the turquoise pop out. Um, little figurines. I think this is the stone critters. Yeah. Eh, I'm going to pass on those. I haven't had um, any luck with these. That one looks like it's signed. Six. Is that six dollars? Yeah. Six, three. Look at the frog. Oh, this one is cute. How cute that is for three. I'm 
tempted. Ooh, look at the perfume. Oh, I love that. It's $20, so. And the doggies. There's Michael's flute. Huh, oh, $8. I don't want to forget this. Some vintage candles. $7.10. And hey, what about this face? Oh, it looks more modern, but. Ooh, it's from linen and things. Gary. $14. I'm gonna look this up, even though it is from linen and things. Okay, so this is normally something you could pick up. Um, he made pottery. This is like a mass produced. A lot of people, some people have a list for like two, three hundred. There's no sold comps. Um, you want to look for his signature. It'll be like studio pottery type, not the mass produced. So I'm going to leave it for 14. I love the vintage canisters. $40 for the set. It's wood. Let's turn it over. I'll turn the tea. That's oh, pretty cool. What year would you say? 70s? The butterflies, oh my gosh. I love it. Are those butterflies or dragonflies? No, it's a butterfly. Um, I would say Taiwan. Okay. It's, they're five dollars each. I'm gonna leave that. It's a ginger jar. There's this here ginger jar. I'm trying to figure out what that whistle is. <laughs> 1981. For four dollars. Not a bad job. Kind of liking these. They're um Asian. Oh, oh my gosh, that scared me. They're made in Korea. I wasn't expecting it to move. <laughs> Brass. Those are six dollars each. I'm happy with my Mexican pottery. Let's go over here. Oh, here's a pottery mug. Let me just get a handle on that. Eh, a little sloppy. Not bad though. Matt Matt Lewis 2006. Oh, it's pretty cool. That one is T A. Florence. Wait, what is this for? Oh no. I don't know what it's for. <laughs> you guys would know better than me for that type of items. I learn a lot from our viewers. Let me see if that's a longer burger made in China. It's pretty. They still have all of these glasses here, the Kentucky Derby. Looks like somebody was a gambler. That looks like a Made in Holland. It's five dollars, so yeah, Delft's blue. I don't know about that. A little hard. I can't get too much more for that. That's a bird. I was trying to figure out what creature that was. <laughs> Ooh, this looks cool. Look, General Electric iron. Oh wow. Ooh, that's heavy. Oh, that's one where you had to you had to spray your own water and iron. Iron away. How much is it? 15. Scale. I love recipe box boxes. This one's wood and it was glued. Eh. Not these. Hookah is still here. <laughs> it's not really a hookah. It's some sort of light. <laughs> it's 20. 
Let me check see if that glows. No. It looks a little bit older though. You can see the straw marks on the bottom. It's $2. I wonder if that was supposed to have a lid. Look how cute this dish is. Oh, it's cracked. Look at the bird, I love it. Look, you get all these little dishes. Ah, it's... You could clean them up and display it in your um, carryo cabinet. Ooh, look at that. Ballerina? What? Never even heard of that. Do I get these 50 cents each? I'm just unsure about these. I looked up sold comps. Um, good condition. Two dishes sell for nine dollars. Um, and this one has a crack and there's a whole bunch of crazing. I mean it's cool if you want it for yourself. This would look awesome if you have um, like mid-century dishes like in a hutch. You could display all of them. Ooh, okay. Jonathan Adler? Fellow! I'm not seeing anything else. Um, I think I'm gonna cash out. 25, we have... I don't know about anybody else, but the older processors work the best. We already have two of them, so... I'm leaving that. Ours has orange on it. 